What's going on guys? I drive it all here. I'm with Tana today and we're working on um, the 63 Chevy. Um, he picked up the other day. 63 with uh, 283 V8 in it. We're on our way to go get an NV3500 for it. Um, so it's a five speed which will really help with miles per gallon. And um, we pulled the 283 out of it and we're gonna get a 350 and drop in. Uh, and those two bolt up, the only thing we'll have to like build is like a transmission mount for it. We also went to Home Depot and got a bunch of like cleaning stuff and paint stuff. Um, Cause we're gonna paint the engine bay today. And uh, also some like wood primer for the bed. I'll, we'll check in with y'all once we get the NV3500 and bring it back to the house to clean it up. Alright, here's the, the NV3500 we got. Five speed. Oh, nice and dirty. Um, it may have been rebuilt. There's like this AWAP, AWAP, AWAP AM 2016. I don't know what that is. It's the, the paint's pretty new. So I think it was like repainted, but it, it may have been rebuilt. We don't really know yet. Um, but yeah, it's very dirty. Um, it's got a hydraulic um, throwout bearing, um, and we're gonna, it's gonna be a bit of trouble for us to figure out how that works. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna go store it and then get working on the truck. All right, so this is all the stuff we got at Home Depot. We got masks, so we don't kill ourselves. This uh, heavy duty oven cleaner is really good to get rid of. Um, all sorts of like oil and stuff in the engine bay, and also just helps like take down a layer of paint. Um, rust reformer, after we get rid of all the rust with our wire brushes, um, we're going to spray a layer of rust reformer, which helps, like after we get a smooth surface with the, the brushes and our sandpaper, um, this will help get us like a nice uh, surface to like um, rough up with 800 grit, and then we're going to paint um, our satin um, primer and paint in one, a satin black. Um, on the engine bay, so it looks nice and looks nice and good. And finally, we got this Thompson waterproof stain. It's an acorn brown, um, and that'll be for the bed. <clears throat> so you can see the bed right now. The wood's all rotting and falling apart. So we got brand new wood, um, brand new metal that goes in between. Um, it should look really good once we're done. So now I'm gonna get started on the engine bay, spraying it down. Here's our red 1963 sip side I was talking about earlier. Um, it's red, but it's got a little surface rust in some spots. Paint's really faded. It's got like a patina look on it now. Um, so we pulled the engine. There's the original four speed in it. That's the original throw bearing. So it's just pulled with the clutch lever here. Um, and then it just pulls. Ours is hydraulic, so we'll have to figure out how we're gonna do that. Probably have to throw in an extra master cylinder right there. Um, so today, be getting all the rust off of this engine bay, um, starting to paint it, uh, get a lot of this cleaned up. It's got a lot, some bad spots in some of the panels for the rust. The wheels aren't too bad. New tires, tires are really good. Yeah. Here's the original 283 we pulled out of the out of the car. Um, little V8. Uh, it wasn't running, but. It probably wouldn't take too much work to get it running. We're gonna throw it on Craigslist pretty soon here. Yeah. We sprayed everything to get it clean with the oven cleaner. And now we're getting the power washer out <coughs> and we're gonna spray everything down. The power washer should get everything looking really good.
hitting all the bad spots of rust, getting it off, starting to look pretty good. So then we'll be able to spray it with the rust reformer. All right, so we've sanded down quite a good bit of the engine bay. Got all the rust off. Now we gotta um, wash it off again to get rid of all the particles. So I'll show you what it looks like here. Got all the big stuff, all the rest, big rust spots out. A lot of the rust off. All the reformers take care of most of the little stuff. But we got all the big stuff off. It looks really good. So we're gonna clean it really quick. So we take out a lot of this puff discoloration. Um, yeah, and then we're gonna run to Home Depot and we'll bring you over. We dried the engine bay, it looks really good. All right, what's up? We started spray painting a little bit. Uh, this is like the rust, rust for finished project of the rust what's it called again <laughs> the rust reformer rust reformer suka bla that looks good dude you know what's gonna suck though dropping an engine in here without scratching the paint 